I wanted to do a quick little tutorial on how I got this design. I went to a nail salon and got these done, but um, when she was doing them, I realized how easy it was. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, and if you want to learn how to get this design, please keep on watching. And the products we're going to be using are the Christine Ashley Base Coat and the Christine Ashley Top Coat as well as a Zoya nail polish in a pink color. I couldn't find the name on the bottle, but this is what the bottom of it says. So if you are looking for um, this nail polish, hopefully the bottom of this will help you. And then I am also using CQ nail polish in night. It's just a black color, it's the only one I had. Then I'm using the New York City Matte Me Crazy Top Coat, um, which is going to give you the matte look. You can see the tips are a little bit shiny, and that's because I put the top coat just on the tips to make them a little bit more um, glossy. But you don't have to do that if you just want a full-on matte look. You're also going to need a cotton ball and a toothpick as well as some nail polish remover, which any brand will work. I have non-acetone. So what you're gonna wanna do first is uh, push your cuticles back and trim them, as well as file them to the shape you want, and you could also buff them out. Just apply a base coat. This is gonna prevent the nail polish from chipping. And then once that base coat has had time to dry, you're just going to apply that pink color from Zoya. Clean up around the cuticle. I'm just using a toothpick with some nail polish remover. And once that's dried a little bit, you're gonna wanna take the black and make a V shape. So you're going to want to go from one corner to the middle. And then repeat the same thing on the other side. And I'm going to go over it again to make it more intense. And then you just want to take a q-tip and go around the edge to pick up that black. And then you just put a top coat on top of that, just on the black part. And then you go over it with the matte top coat. And almost instantly it turns matte. This stuff is like two or three dollars for a pretty, you know, good size. Um, I don't think you need to go out and get like OPI or, um, I know like higher ends have, you know, like really expensive ones. This one does a really great job at mattifying your nail polishes. Um, and I know my nail doesn't look as great as the others, that's because the other ones were done by professionals. And I think, you know, anyone could do it. Actually, I know anyone could do it because I don't do nails. So <laughs> me doing this is very surprising. If you liked this design, please give the video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.